he was like an honorary captain at the well, Denver it, Police it Department. It was the Memphis Mafia. Yeah. You know? yeah. I mean, that's... But, but yeah, he. I, I think he also... Um, I think Nixon made him an honorary Secret Service agent or something like that. So, yeah, it is. It's it's cool. It's a cool culture. Uh, 284-5966. Let's see if Brian wants. Brian, what's your question for 5 Hey, I got a quick question for you. Uh, kind of a two-part question. Are the speed cameras turned on on 235? Yeah, it has been since, I think, once late April. Okay, so then if, if you're headed eastbound and then uh, oftentimes you guys are radaring out there trying to keep traffic control down, that type of thing, if you get a speed camera and then uh, one of your officers happened to catch it speeding, is that is there a way to go back and say you got two tickets or is that just <laughs> sorry about your luck and follow the rules? Well, that, that's a good question. I, I think uh, our, our operation plan is typically we're not going to do that. I mean, there's different speed zones right there. But we're, we're not going to add insult to injury, so we try and spread ourselves out there. But, um, yeah, I, I'm sure we would be able to, to resolve that fairly. <laughs> oh, man, the speed cameras. Everybody loves the speed cameras. Iowa guy just tweeted in a picture, let's be cops. Fake cops, real trouble. Referring to the guy that wanted a hat. I, yeah. I will say that my mind first went to something nefarious. Like, what do you need a, a hat for? What are you going to do with it? But I realized that, yes. People do. Just collect. Now, when I was a kid, uh, my grandpa played golf in a pro-am tournament with uh, his partner was Marty Milner, who was an Adam 12. And, and he brought You're me... a doppelganger. Yeah. No, that was, that's... Oh, right. oh, it is? Okay, sorry. Yeah, but anyway, my grandpa brought me back a hat, and uh, he had signed it, and, and I thought that was probably the coolest thing ever, and I ruined in the floods in 93, but um, Marty Milner, that was something that was not uncommon at all for him to autograph uh, paraphernalia like that. Yeah, but Heather, I mean, just go to, a, you know, I don't know how many there are around now, but, you, you know, the Army surplus stores, back when they were, like, really Army surplus stores, there was one in Council Bluffs I used to hang out all the time because they just, they would bring in, like, all this old crap, and you'd go through, and you're like, this is cool, this is cool. I got an old Navy peacoat there. I got an old Army parka, like, was, I mean, you could just find all sorts of stuff, and I'd buy it. I started my... I, I, my, my first headset microphone I, was an old, like, chopper microphone headset, and it worked, and I started recording myself back when I was 16 years old. It's amazing what you can find at these surpluses. Is there an Army surplus in town anymore in Des Moines? Yeah, I think, I think there is. I think there used to be one down on the south side. Yeah, but I don't know if there is, you know, now with eBay and everything else, I don't know if they're as popular as... You know, and I, you know, you want to put your money in a good spot. You know, I, I check, you know, Goodwill or Salvation yeah. Army. You know, that stuff's going to roll in there, and, and, and that, that's going to a great cost. Oh, my God. What are we going to get here? Hey, Reverend geez. Ray. Oh, boy. Hey, good morning. What's up? Just wanted to add to the conversation. Uh, I know Five O is a big Elvis fan. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, actually, uh, Nixon uh, made uh, Elvis an honorary uh, narcotics DEA agent. Ah, oh, DEA, okay. Amazing. All, the, all the irony there. <laughs> hey, I got a question. Uh, hey, Travis, man, uh, I just need 50K to pay off my mortgage, man, when you hit that uh, Mega Millions. Uh, you know what, Ray? I I will buy 50K? you. 50K? I mean, come on, man. I will, I will pay off your mortgage at 50K. All right. We got it on, we got it on tape. Hey, and, uh, only question, only guess, if you uh, agree not to smoke weed anymore. <laughs> that ain't happening. <laughs> You can't. It, it ain't happening. But hey, my question, I guess, uh, 5-0, uh, did you go to the uh, uh, Slipknot Slaughterhouse? Oh, no, not yet. But we, that was something we oh, didn't talk about. Oh, you should take the kids, man. It's awesome, man. It's not taking the kids. Park, right? I feel like we shouldn't take the kids. Yeah, maybe the oldest, it's but a, not, the, not the youngest. And uh, are you guys going to Alice Cooper tonight? Where's Alice Cooper tonight? I think he's... Is he at Hoyt Sherman? Or the Hoyt Sherman Place. Yeah. Hoyt Sherman Place. No, he's at the Civic Center. Oh, okay. Civic, okay. No, we're not going no. to. All right. All right. Have a good day. Thanks, Indeed. man. You want to talk about just random questions from Reverend Ray. Travis, will you pay my mortgage? Heather and 5 did you go to the Slaughterhouse thing? Are you going to Alice Cooper? Okay, bye. And by the way, did anybody catch that he's not going to stop smoking yeah. pot yeah. to get his mortgage paid off? That's Here's a pretty a... deep commitment to smoking pot. 